you doing? I'm getting my metal detector ready because we're off metal detecting. Yeah. Proper field where there's been a coin found, a gold coin found, two gold coins found, one of them being about 700 year old gold coin. Interesting. Yep, so I'm very, very excited. Do you think you're going to find one with this today? I know for a fact I'm going to find two with this oh, yeah. today. One for me, one for you. I better find three, am I, so that uh, Christian can have one, the lad who's invited us. Yeah. We'll find three. Yeah. Hello and welcome to Deep Digger Dam Metal Detecting again with a new friend. I've met a new friend. I've only known him two minutes and I love him to bits. This is Christian, right? You'd know him as Christian, but it's spelt wrong. It's got two A's at the end. Christy, A A N. Christian. And it's spelled like that because he's, he's from South uh, Africa. Africa. His name's from Holland? Uh, Dutch, yes. Dutch. Holland, same thing. Yeah, same thing. Same Beto. thing. Uh, and he invited us out. I put on Facebook the other day, is there anybody who can take us metal detecting anywhere? And we've been invited, haven't we, Mazzy? Yeah. We've come here. Now he's got here the finds he's had from the fields he's been doing. Okay. Check them out. Just look, Mazzy. Yeah. Let's start at the bottom, look. So you've got some Roman coins, some penny. That's a lovely Roman coin. Don't know if you can see that on the camera. Loads of hammered coins, halves and full, of all different eras, are they? Yeah, yeah, yeah everything yeah. from King George down to... Right down King to Edward. Edwards, yeah. Yeah. And then you've got relics. Some fantastic, that's a, oh, you've got Roman fibulas. Roman trumpet brooch. They brooch. really do go back every... The Saxon, Saxon, Saxon. Gold, Saxon. gold gilt. Portion is broken, but beautiful. Saxon, yeah. What is that Saxon? Uh, that is a uh, royal guard, imperial guard um, brooch or a badge. What kind of age? Uh, so that's not uh, that old. It's then. not that old. No, be uh, 20th century. I thought with the little dots, it looked a bit Saxonish. Mm. And the creme de la creme. Look at this lot. All these silver coins here. Well, I say creme de, 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 de creme de la creme, creme. I don't even know the word anymore. The hammered coins are the most amazing for me so far, but yeah, he's got loads of silvers there as well. Not as good as them. Not as good as them. But look at this. Where are they, Mazzy? Where are they? Come on, let's I'm stop talking. Really where we've, where have, they're under this? Yeah. He's found two gold coins on these permissions. Um, one is I think they call them a bullhead. Ed, uh, who is it? It's uh, King George the Fourth. George the Fourth. Oh, it's not a bullhead then. I think he's the third. I'm not going to take that one out, but it is absolutely immaculate. 18. Can't read it. 22. 1822. Mm -hmm. That is beautiful. And I'm going to take this one out. This is special. Mazzy, move on to this one. Look at this. They're all special. Gold honey. coin from 1350. 30 year. I'll put it on my hand so you can see it properly. Oh, wow. What do they call this, Christian? <laughs> half noble. A half noble. <gasps> it's literally so worth nice. thousands. It was found right behind me. Guess where I'm going? Come on, Christian. Come on, Let's Christian. Go. We're going to find another <laughs> ten of these. Look at this. It's gold. Here. We're going here. So this is one of my favourite relics, Christian. <laughs> what is it? Exactly? It's a Roman brooch. It's a Roman umbrunate brooch. Yeah. Still got the pin intact. Oh, wow. So, so, yeah, obviously someone was very sad when they lost that. Oh, gosh. Not found here. Not found, not found here. Beautiful. Yeah. And this look. I know it's not yeah. as exciting, but it's a, a pen. It's even yes. still got lead in it. A silver pen with, I presume that's lead. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. That is lovely. Oh, it's beautiful. I don't know, 1800s? Yeah, maybe? it was 19, 1800s around there. Yeah. Wow, he's ugly. Look, is that Roman? No, no, no. It's, uh, it, it looks Roman though, doesn't it, with a thing on his head? Yeah, no, they they they, they believed it was Roman and, and then the, the coroner told me different. Oh, yes, I see it. Can you see the man's head yes. there? Yes. That is beautiful. Oh, wow. I thought it was just costume jewellery from the Victorian times because I yeah. found a lot of things like this. 
but that is stunning. Have you been this year since you ploughed it? Did, did you get in? I when did it's... not. So this is not going to since the last plough? No. So, uh... Christian, I want to know <laughs> your... Christian! Re... Christian! What was your reaction when you found the gold um, coin? Well, to be, to be honest, I found the uh, sovereign first and about two days later I found the other coin. So I was like, yeah, it's just a normal thing, you know, just find them every just day. Just a normal thing, yeah, find it every day. Yeah. Yeah. Even though I didn't <laughs> find them and I'm holding them, my reaction is, oh, look at these, look at these, they've got coins. Look at them, look at them, look at them, look at them. <laughs> so how you contained yourself, I don't know. Fantastic, fantastic. Let's go find some Let's more. Let's go find some more. So, what are you working with today, Christian? I've got the Expedeus, a nice uh, high frequency coil, looking for the small cut halves, cut quarters. That's what I'm going for today. Looks like uh, Dan is look, looking for the hoards. No, I'm not. Ones. I'm just looking for the big chunks of coin, uh, gold. <laughs> yeah. So, I've got a big coil on a big beast. So We're looking for different things, you see. What's the pattern looking for half cut little silver bits when you can find <laughs> the big chunks of gold? You know, aim high. Very good, let's go. Let's go. So it's very stubbly here as well, isn't it? It isn't bad actually. No? A lot of stubble. Because they've only just been cut, it's always a worry they're going to be too hard and too high, and this is quite low. So it isn't bad. And it's not too hard, really. Good. I'm worried it's still going to be too hard as well. So you've got your tactics going on, honey, haven't you? I've got my tactics going on, yeah. Yeah. Gold coin Shh, found Christians, behind that bill. That's Chris, exactly right. Christian's where I'm only there. Look, oh, I think he's got something already. Has he got some already? Yeah. He's got thick legs, hasn't he? I know. Why have you got <laughs> Check his legs, legs out, guys. Uh, running away from police normally. <laughs> okay, we won't film that oh, bit. <laughs> Nearly where it's stashed gold coins are. They found it just on the other side of this bale. What are you doing here? Get over there, babe. Get oh, over there. Yeah, but they might have been scattered this way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, just iron. How do you know it's iron? Please explain. Because it's coming up as 09 on my thing. Right. If it's good, it's going to be. 30 plus. Oh, okay. Probably. Gold will probably be about 49. Ooh. Anything good, Christian? No, unfortunately, just. No. Uh, what is it? It's lead. Oh, okay. Which well. is always a good sign on a field. A find is a find. <laughs> Have you got something? Oh, he's reaching out for the spade. I don't think it's anything. It's jumping all over the place. But Is I there? To, I need to dig a hole. Yeah, you're not dug one yet. Let's get started. Just a blip of iron, but it is an, an unusual shape. But I don't think it's anything. It's your first find. It's my first find. Yeah. I knew it was going to be something just like that. Yeah. I think I'll serve myself for a proper signal next time. Best find of the day, but it's nothing to get excited about. Don't know. Looks like a clasp off a chest of gold coins. <laughs> You're getting there. You're nearly there. Ah, ooh. My guess is it's a very, very old uh, nail. Oh, that's cool. Square nail, an old iron nail head. Yeah, I like that. That's what it certainly looks like. 100 years, 200 years old. Not what we're after. You nailed that, didn't you? I did nail that. And all my nails. You look excited. It's taken a while, but I finally found something good. Okay, let's dig. Dig, 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 dig. I think it's a coin, but I'm not sure. <laughs> it's taking me a while. 
Just a reminder guys, this is where the gold coin was found and Dan's come down this way. Oh yeah. Oh! What is that? It's a piece oh, God. of rubbish. Unbelievable, unbelievable, I've lost my touch. Mazzy, I've lost my touch. I'm rubbish at metal detecting now. I'm going to go down to the end here and I'm going to let you have a go. Yay! But I do think you're going to struggle with this okay. heavy machine on stubble. I'll be honest with you. Yeah, I probably will. <laughs> it's Mazzy's turn. And she's already had the best signal we've had today. You need the pinpointer, there yeah. you go. Now this is registering in the 70s and late 60s. Whereas all mine so far have been well below that, so... Hopeful. So here we are looking for gold coins and hammered coins and half hammered coins from the 1300s, 1400s, 1500s. And you're happy with that find, are you? I am. <laughs> what is it? Half a horseshoe, I think. It is, it's half of a horseshoe. Yeah. A very big horse. Um, that means I'm half lucky then. You are half yeah. lucky, but you need to be fully lucky. It's not good enough, yeah. Mazzy. It's really not good enough. Come on, yeah. step up your game. Yeah. Mazzy, have you seen it on the news this week, going on about people who are, you know, using helium gas and putting it in their animals and stuff yeah. as a joke? They think it's funny. It's been on news this week. It's disgusting, isn't it? Yeah. It's, well, I say it's disgusting. Personally, I think it's each to their own. That's what they want to do. Whatever floats your goat. <laughs> Whatever floats your goat, helium gas. It's a joke. It's a joke, Mazzy. Yeah. <laughs> so here she comes. Our Mazzy. She's finding it very difficult. I knew she would today. This is heavy. It's a very heavy machine. Well, it's not, to be honest. It's not a very, very heavy machine. The coil's quite heavy. It's because there's a big coil on it. But going through stubble when you've not done a proper field before, which Mazzy hasn't really. I can't swing it. She can't swing it. Bless her. This is why, like Christiane, who is over there, God knows what he's found. Christiane has a, a dais, and I've always said, a dais, if you can afford a dais, get a dais. But because that's, for a woman, I mean, it is a dream machine. It is so, so light. Like you can see Mazzy struggling with this one. <laughs> Just leave Mazzy to it for a moment. Let's go see how Christian's doing. Anything? Uh, lead. Lead? Lead and more lead and some more. Oh, nothing special then? No, part no. of a crotal bell. Part of a crotal bell, that's always good. I do like crotal bells. Oh, you, oh, yeah, you've got a nice little, nice little buckle. More than we've found. Okay. He's found a coin. Half penny, 1918. And he's complaining he's not found all. Part of a crotal bell, yeah. Very good Christian. That's a nice mm. part of a crotal bell. Well, that's about and a it. button. No silver, no gold. Never Just mind, it. never mind. We'll, um, somewhere in there, somewhere in there, to find it. We'll find it. Sorry, I have to translate for you because he's <laughs> South African. Um, but yeah, that's what he was trying to say. By the way, on the way here, I popped into a shop. I was going to get six cans of Sprite. And I got home and I'd picked seven up. Oh, wow. It's a joke. Sprite, six cans of Sprite, but I'd picked seven up. Seven up is very si similar to Sprite. Do you know the two drinks? Uh, yes, I do. Yeah. <laughs> Is that a funny joke or not, now that you it know is, it? Yeah, it's I a brilliant it, joke. Yeah, it's yeah, brilliant. Yeah. You'll have to excuse him. He's South African. Still in there. Oh, 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 oh. It's round, it's round, it's round. It? It's round, it's a button. It's a button. Taken us a while, but we finally found something. It's a little pewter button. Nothing special. Is it old? It's not that old, 1800s. Um, but yeah, a button, as first proper find. This is the field, I'm telling you. The gold was over there, but if you remember, there were a bad yeah. storm in... When was that storm? About 2007 or something, there were a really bad storm, and I think it's been blown over here mm -hmm. as all the gold. So let's get finding the gold now. 
Yep, so Dan, as Dan just said, we was in this field, we've just come through. This was his first find, the button. I don't know what Christian's up to. Surely if the gold is washed through though, babe, it'll be up along here somewhere on right, the other we're side. we're a really bad storm. Oh, okay. Trust me. <laughs> The gold starts about here and it go, it's pretty much scattered. It's scattered over a few hundred metres. I think I found my first gold of the day. It's definitely hammered, it's definitely small. It's definitely in here. And it's definitely mine. <laughs> oh. oh, it's there, look, it's not a coin. Okay. Tell you what I think it is. Buckle? I might be wrong, it's like a clog clasp or something. Ooh. It might be a clog clasp. You know it'd be on your clo clog and clasp. Don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I can't remember. It's that long since I metal detected and found these. But I think that might be a clog clasp. Did you make that up? No, I didn't make that up. <laughs> Beautiful. But not what I thought it was. I'm going to leave you to search for more lead. I'm going to see how Christian's getting on. Any updates? How are you right. getting on? Found buttons. And buttons? To dress a few people. Oh, really? Uh, other than that, there's more lead. Yeah, that's all buttons, Dan's. Buttons, oh, buttons. Dan just found something similar to that. Yeah, yeah. pewter buttons. Yeah. And more buttons. <laughs> and oh, more buttons. Yeah. Solid signal I've had all day. Oh really? It's gonna be the plow itself I reckon. <laughs> it's like gold signal. Dig it! Dig it! Faster! Small then is that? Golden lead signal. You don't look happy. It's a piece of lead. Yeah, but that's the kind of lead they used to use to wrap the gold up to protect it. Okay. <laughs> you look hot! <laughs> yeah, we've just come back for a quick break. Yeah. It's a killer today, it is hot. Um, I think what we're going to do is try some pasture instead of some stubble and maybe put the smaller coil on and give that a blast. Yeah, it's awfully hot isn't it darling? Yeah, it's hot. Yeah. Do some ice cubes, but with no freezer. Or fridge. Or fridge. <laughs> Just come back for a drink, and so I could swill my head. And Christian, Christian, um, found this on the way back. And he thought it was a silver hammer. I said, nah, it's too smooth. There's nothing on it, on this side. Look, it's very smooth. There's nothing on there. It's the right size, right shape, but... Then he opened it up and look, there is some kind of cross on there. But that is not like a cross you would get on a hammered coin normally. It's... Don't know, you said it could be Masonic or something, didn't you? We don't know, we don't might know. Might be, might be. Hopefully it is, be my first. Gets me out back in the fields. But you can certainly see the cross, it's something. There's something in there. It's I'm... better than everything i found so far today, Christian. Come on, take me onto a pasture where there's something special. We'll do. Got some cows on there, something. I don't want a cow, I want gold. I've gotten a cross, but Dan don't think he's going to well, make ow. it. Uh-oh, careful. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Sorted. Sorted. Yay. I helped him across, you see. <laughs> you helped him, did you? Yeah. Thank oh, yes. you. Look what I've just found. It's a balloon. Sparkly on it, right? Mazzy loves sparkly. And look, it says happy birthday. Look at the number, look at the number. It's number 40. Number 40. Sparkly happy birthday balloon. Mazzy? How old are you? 39. 39, so you're 40 next, yeah? Some people say I'm tight. That ain't being tight, is it? That's just being sensible. We've got a balloon here for her 40th birthday. That's going in my bag. She'll get that. When, when's your birthday? February the 10th. February the 10th. She'll get that in February. Sorted. What a find. What a find.